Hi everybody, it's Bobby from Fifth Avenue Cakes, and today we're going to create a cute, adorable royal icing woodland box inside a royal icing zipper. So let's begin. You will need to start with a fancy square cookie that I have already marked off with edible marker, a number two piping nozzle, and cream flood consistency royal icing. Go ahead and fill in the small little triangle. Use your scribe tool to evenly distribute the royal icing. You will need to put the cookie in front of a fan or in a dehydrator for two hours and then let it dry overnight or at least eight hours. Now with burgundy royal icing, a number three nozzle and flood consistency, pipe half of your fancy square at a time. Be sure to, to butt the icing up against the cream colored royal icing. Now use your scribe tool to evenly distribute the royal icing and to bring out the point. Now fill in the other side of the cookie, bringing the burgundy icing right up against that cream color icing. Now use your scribe tool to evenly distribute the other half of the royal icing. You can either place this cookie in front of a fan for two hours or in a dehydrator for two hours and then allow it to dry for eight hours after that. To transfer your woodland fox, use a tissue paper method with a rainbow dust marker and the small point inside. Trace over your woodland fox character.
and there it is. Now with the number two nozzle and rust or burnt red color for lighting, blood consistency, pipe the outline of the fox's head. Use your scribe tool to evenly distribute the icing. And then with a light pink, go ahead and pipe in the little pads for his ears. Use your scribe tool to evenly distribute it and to pull it up around his ear. Now pipe out the little part of his body with your rust color red. And evenly distribute your realizing with your scribe tool. Pipe the center of his body with a number one nozzle and that pink flood consistency icing. Evenly distribute the icing and bring it up around his neck. Allow your fox to dry overnight. Now let's add in our zipper. With a 1.5 nozzle and soft peak consistency icing, begin by piping three rows right up against one another so that they're touching. If you don't have a 1.1 nozzle, you go with a number one. Continue piping the other side exactly the same way. To add the teeth to your zipper, go ahead and pipe some beads.
coming up from that first line you piped. Now go ahead and add to your zipper pulp, and when your icing is dry, you can paint it with the classic gold dust, so it matches your zipper pulp. To put his face on, just with your rainbow dust marker, pipe two little eyes, a little curved nose, and a little open mouth. Add some detail to his ears. And a little bit of fur to his collar. Thank you so much for joining me and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.